so let's see. You said you played this out with Wandering Winder a little bit, right? Mm, I've played against a bot, I think. Oh. I don't think I've played this against a human. Okay. Um, Obviously, you open bureaucrat moat. Yeah. Obviously. You gotta open moat so you're safe from the bureaucrat attack. Yeah. Um, Even if you don't... about opening iron works, but, like, I don't think the iron works actually speeds you up to what the iron works would be doing, which is getting bridges and villages. I don't think that the iron works is actually speeding you up and just buying one of those. Um... Uh... I was going to say, so, like, he has four here. So even if he doesn't get the bureaucrat, I still think I'm going to get the moat because I'm going to want a lot of moats in my deck. Yeah. Yeah. I could open mm -hmm. double moat. Yeah, man. Um, I would like to hit price points someday. So, like, I could just go straight for the, like, bridge native village thing. Um, uh -huh. that might be something I experiment with just as a baseline, but like, I would like to get price points so that I can get an expand. That seems better. Um, is it better? Going straight for a native village bridge seems really bad to me. Well, it usually is, but like, there isn't a whole lot else going on here. There's other um, ways to draw cards and other villages and attacks. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Let's at least get a baseline for what the native village bridge thing feels like if you just beeline for it. I'm happy for you, man. Ooh, I could get a native village. Yeah, man. Give me one of those. That actually matters. So, like, because he's going straight for native village bridge, uh... You know, it means that I might want to contest one of these piles. Sure. Um, hmm. It's okay. I didn't want to draw that Haunted Woods or anything. Don't worry about it. This is fine, I guess. Hey. Okay. I guess I'm going to do that. Probably take a moat here. Moat probably helps more than not moat. Your face probably helps more than not moat. Yeah, that's right. I went there. I went there, Yeah, Jake. man. You did, man. Bridge over crown, huh? Yeah. Okay, man. Uh, okay, crown might have been better. Crown would have been better. I didn't really think. Of it. I'm I'm doing a purposely like very simple-minded bridge native village thing because I want to see how that is. But if I was willing to put some more thought into it, yeah, crown is probably better. That's a pretty good excuse. All right. Uh, let's see. So if I take the bridge over crown here, I'm lowering piles, and I'm not actually, I, like, is that helpful for me, or is that not helpful? Is is piles being low in my favor, or is it a detriment? I'm not really sure. Um, I'm going to say it's in my favor because, um, because your of thing reasons, is going to be yeah. better in the long term. Yeah. Like, 
But then again, I'm getting kind of low on terminal space. Let's take the crown, actually. I think the crown is better for the deck. And I don't want any more mutts. <clears> ha! 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 Look at that. That's so many actions, Jake. Yeah, man, you're ready. My body is ready. Okay, I want the Haunted Woods. Jake, I have nine actions. Are you jealous? Yeah, man. If you had died him. Yeah. Right now. That would be the bee's knees. Wow, this... I feel did I like... tell you, I actually, I actually did have this weird game where, like, I won because I got Diadem with a big stack of villagers. Like, the stack of villagers had come from, like, recruiter food, and I won because, like, I took Diadem with tournament and, like, turned them all into money. Like, everyone was talking about... Every, whenever a new set comes out, the first uh, jokey sort of like, oh, man, this is so broken with Diadem. Like, everyone tries to think, like, is Diadem finally good? But I actually had one. I'm proud of you, man. Okay. I want... So, let's see. can go for or copper copper just because you oh, there's you the a non-zero yeah. chance that you like pile out on your turn This was actually the saddest draw I can imagine. Um, Wait, are you serious right now? You're complaining? <laughs> yeah, this was bad. Um, okay. Not great. I'm not like where this. I'm not where this deck wants to be. <laughs> um, <laughs> okay. I'm not. You're doing way better than normal. I'm doing way worse than normal. I think. I'm doing way worse uh, than I did against the bot. I have I hit five like zero times after like getting my first haunted woods and I got an expand. I hit five like zero times after that. See. Probably because I got a bunch of native villages that I didn't really want. I mean, my native village mat is not really what needs to be on my native village mat right now. And that's a big deal for what this oh, deck is. Oh, you just got, you just moated me. That was so yeah, ill. Click on the auto reveal for that. There needs to be a little PSA about auto reveals. Because I feel like a lot there of needs to be a PSA really about the whole client. <laughs> it's You're funny not wrong because about any of that. It's funny because I'm making one. Yeah, that's what makes it funny. That's funny. Okay. Uh, I very well might. Okay, I might have it next turn. We'll see. I guess I should pick that up. Should I pick that up? Are you looking at five cards? Ooh, I drew a mountain village. I drew a moat. That's pretty sweet. Should I crown this moat? Or do I wait to crown the bridge? I've got, like, a bunch of moats in there. I have, like, three moats, right? There's two more moats in there? 
So I could like overdraw and like get a crypt out this turn, right? Let's crown this moat. I drew two moats. Check me out. is actually probably good. Well, wait, no. I don't know that it is. I just... Jake, wait, how did you... I got a dollar... Oh, yeah, bridge. Bridge can iron, yeah. I got a dollar and an action bridge from gaining a crown sense. with ironworks, Jake. Yeah, I did, forgot. Did you that. see that? That was so ill. I forgot that could happen. That was so yeah, ill. Yeah, sick. Yeah, it was, that was so ill. Okay, so... um. I overdrew this turn, but I had to pick up five cards from my native village. No, I don't think I started with five cards. I started with, like, four you cards. You had five on the native village. I had started the turn with watching. three. It was five when I picked it up, but I started oh. the turn with... Yeah. No, I started the turn with four. Yeah, I started the turn with four cards in my native village, Matt, but I overdrew this turn, and I had crown on haunted woods. So... When I crypt this turn, I'm going to have seven fewer cards in my deck, also in a state less. So I shouldn't need to crown the Haunted Woods. I should be able to get away with crowning the bridge. If I crown the bridge, I will have four, six, thirteen dollars, four buys, and everything will cost two less. I will have... Two bridges in my deck. I'm going to need that third bridge. <sighs> if I... Uh, other options. I could play the bridge, crown the silver... I still can't get Dominate and Fountain points this turn. I don't think Dominate and Fountain this turn is a winning play. How many cards are on his mat? 12? Yeah, I'm not afraid. Maybe I should be. It takes. He doesn't have any other gains in his deck, though, besides those bridges. And he needs to gain 9 cards... To win the game, the only way he can do that is by playing all eight bridges, in which case, you know, I lose. So he has to play all eight bridges. He's got 12 cards on his mat, and... Don't forget the deck, don't forget that. I'll forget whatever I want to forget. Don't you tell me what to do. He... Well, I'm just saying, I don't need to play all eight bridges. I need to play seven bridges, because there's a crown somewhere in there. I need to play seven bridges plus the crown. I... Yeah, I need to play. You need to play bridges, bridge one eight times. Yeah. So you have. But if I can do that, you're right. I lose. So that's one, two, really three, four, four five, six. Way. You have like eleven more cards you need to draw. Like there is at least one bridge in your discard pile, but I don't know. He might be able to do If he can do that, I don't think... I mean, there's nothing I can do to stop that. I need to assume I get one more turn. Whatever. I don't think I should crown the Haunted Woods. Let's just do this and then think about more things. Uh, probably don't need to get that bridge in this very moment. I can, like, maybe Ironworks gain it next turn and then crown it or something. So I really want to put crowns in the deck. I could put, like, a couple of crowns and something else in the deck. I don't know. Oh, wait. Moats are at five. Well, I have a decent shot of losing the game next turn. Sweet. Who went first? Can I complain about that? It was him. Neato. I mean, you could complain about it even if it was you. Nobody would stop you. 
Well, I mean, they might comment on it, but, like, I'm not going to stop you now. Yeah, I can just, like, so mute your audio and complain about it to the video. Yeah. You got a good point. Yeah, you've, I mean, you don't even have to do that. Like, yeah, I'm, just, <laughs> I'm not going to stop you from complaining about what you want to. This is America. <laughs> the land of the free and the home of the brave. That's right, man. I want that. Let's just get more piles even lower. I love that. It's so good. So on the bright side for you, if I don't win next turn, I think I just lose the game straight up. That's likely, yeah. I need more gains. That's what's going to help me win the game next turn. Um, but I can't get crown okay, or bridge. So you're right about that, but something to consider is that, like, do you need to win the game next turn? Like, you have to assume you get at least one more turn, but if the game goes long, I think you're favored, right? Like, I have to win next turn or I lose, I think. I mean, what, what's my recourse if I can't win next turn? Like, I don't, what I'm saying is I don't you think... You win on the following models. turn, like... Sure. But, like, I need to win the game as. I need to win the game as quickly as possible before you just go off. This is true. I can't outscore you now, so I need to make it so I can outscore you next turn. Yeah, but do more, do more, do, uh, having more gains, does that actually help you? Yeah. I need to get three coppers and some points and then also empty piles. That's a lot of gains. I don't know. I think if you get two dominates, screw can you even do can you do I that? I can't I can barely get one next turn. I'm gonna crypt away all of my money. Oh, okay. Never mind. Forget everything I said. I didn't Okay, you get a province and This is really cool. The buttons for problems. done setting aside and undo are like on top of the cards I'm clicking on. And then I can't see how many coppers I have selected because it won't show me. Isn't that nice. cool? Help me, under help me understand why you got a province, though. That seems terrible from where I'm sitting, but why did you do that? I don't know. You're it not taking a lead with it. I'm going to need it eventually, I guess. Like, if you're not I taking a wanna... lead, why are you making that pile easier to empty? If you're emptying provinces, I'm losing anyway. If I'm getting seven provinces, you might not be. If you're getting seven provinces, getting seven you're getting provinces. a bridge and five moats. Yeah, but, like, why would you get the province at all? It makes your deck works and makes the pile. I, okay. Like, I think you would just... The pile of provinces... I mean, I need to gain something. I, I figure that's a gain that I know I'm going to need to end the game. I mean, maybe it should have been an Ironworks. But, like, the the quantity of provinces in the pile is definitely not a consideration there. Let's find out what's going on here. This is looking a lot like I'm dead. Well, maybe not. Hang on. So, let's see. You have to have, like, seven bridges in hand, right? Um, and a crown? Huh? Just go and ahead. And a crown. So, I... Down to two. I'll have 12 money. Do I? Hang on. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, I do. If I can do... Um, 
let's try to basically just do the same thing I did last time. Um, I'm not saying that it's what I think is best, but I I, I do want to see because I'm not convinced it's not best. You still there? Yeah. Adam? Oh, yeah, okay. I'm here. I don't know. What do you usually do against the bot? I usually have access to more than two bridges. I usually build to a bridge turn with crowns and bridges. I get a lot of crowns and bridges in play. And then I win the game. Weird when it's contested, isn't it? You got a lot of bridges. Native Village Bridge, when it gets that many bridges, like, that's not normal. I think you got amazing draws. Um, I don't think that that's true. I'm quite but... certain that it's true. You went off on turn 12. That's I really mean, the good. the deck's not that... The de that's, that's good, but that's not that unusual for that deck. It's a high yeah, it's variance unusual for that deck, deck, but the deck is... It's really not. I mean, I've played that deck a lot. The deck is not. I've played the deck a lot too. It's deck. unusual for that deck. The native, the na the native bridge bridge deck is pretty decent. Uh -huh. Um, as in, like you go for it a lot of the time, even when there's something else you could be doing. I'm thinking that might be the case here, though I'm not convinced. Cool. Oh no. He had a moat. So immune to this attack. What a disaster. The attack I actually wish... was annoying one time. I wish he didn't have that moat. What if he didn't have that moat? Yeah. Nobody wants that. It's so bad. <clears throat> sure, I guess I'll get that bridge. I don't really want it, but I'm getting it anyway. I mean, you can't let me have it. Uh, okay, so what am I doing? Um, do I take a native village here? Uh, it seems dangerous. Wait, what do you have in your deck? I don't actually think that is dangerous. Let's see. The Haunted Woods out, so like... Um, I don't think I'm worried. Have you, like, ever set aside a bridge with a native village between this game and last game? Has that, like, even happened for you once? Yeah, quite a bit. It's just you don't need to... You don't need for that not to happen. It's not a big deal. Yeah, but it's really great when it doesn't happen. 
there, it's 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 good, but like you need all, all the, everything you need here is so cheap. Like, what does that really even set you back? You get more bridges faster. A little bit, but like you don't need them. There's crown if you uh, if if you don't get your bridges fast enough, you get crowns to supplement. Denying the opponent bridges, now that's a big deal. Um, so yeah, what you're saying is is definitely a thing for denying the opponent's bridges. On the other hand, you've had 13 turns already and you haven't gone off, which is worse than last game. Somehow, I'm doing a lot worse than last game. I'm really, like, I'm contesting him differently, and this has turned out worse for me. I'm not really thinking about, like, how I'm contesting him or, like, what I should or shouldn't be doing. Probably isn't great. Oh, yeah, I should win this turn, right? Good. Let's see. Um, maybe not. Oh, I made it just fucked up. Cool. I messed up. Oops. Oh, so you didn't ever set any set any bridges aside. I did. I did definitely. Okay. They. I've had two bridges aside on my mat for a long time. Why did you? Uh, buy. A... It. I messed oh. up. Uh... I thought you could afford to dominate, and then I realized that provinces didn't cost eight, and it all made more sense. Well, that was terrible. have game yet i think i do right yeah oh whoops there goes parker banging on the keyboard like he'd do You, uh, yeah, Parker, he, he's been, his thing recently is he's been, like, reaching out and grabbing stuff, and he just wants to I grab like everything now. Let's get a moat. worth doing. Wow, this happened. Okay. Silvers. That surprises me. I'm not convinced it's bad, but like I'm surprised that, to see it happen. Silver's fine. It's just like, what is it doing for you? Everything. It's a serious question. What is it doing for you? You're trying to get an expand? That answers that. Yeah.
Oh, nice. This is great. Probably need to do these. That was a disaster. This has been really weird starting on turn one when I drew five coppers. Think that was good for you or bad? Well, it didn't feel good, but I don't know. It's hard to say. Well, it's on my mat, silver. Kind of want that. If you open 5-2, I think that you don't just bum rush me to Village Bridge. Ooh, we're going to find out what happens. Uh, with that rules thing um, that I was talking about. What's that? So I crowned a Haunted Woods last turn, and then I set the crown aside with the crypt that I used to double the Haunted Woods. Nice. So we're going to see what happens. That's pretty sick. That was so ill. I'm pretty far behind at this point, so, uh... Okay, well, it worked. Oh, I think that, like, worse for the native village bridge tech than setting bridges aside is setting native villages aside. Like, that seems way worse than setting bridges aside early on. I'm gonna disagree. If you set native villages aside then you can just play bridges and buy more native villages. But if you set bridges aside, a lot of times you have trouble hitting four. You don't need to hit four. Wow, you're being like, okay. I see what you mean. Um, not a problem. Hasn't been for me, or maybe I just haven't been paying attention, and it has actually slowed me down. So I need that bridge pretty bad. What? Because I, I don't have you any bridges. Off. You have nine bridges. So you don't have any? Yeah, I don't have any bridges. In hand or in deck? Uh, in my deck. Fairly certain I lose the game next turn. Most cases. So this game was different. Oh. I feel like I'm accomplishing things, and it's turn 13. And I didn't attempt to contest you at all. Like, I didn't even think about, like, oh, I need to get... What's, what's he going to be short on? I should get a lot of those. I didn't even think about that this game, and I'm, my deck is doing way better. Match that. When you build deck right, it performs better. I've also, um, and I mean, that's not saying that this is the only reason that this game is going different. My draws have been pretty bad this uh, time around, so 
Um, well, like, I mean, we, we'd be I'm playing a non-interactive where... game, and you would have had, like, 14 or 15 cards on your mat by now. Right. So, like, what I'm taking away from this is that um, there's a bunch of... There's straight-up Native Village Bridge bum rush, and then there, which is simple-minded, and there's it's down to a, a formula. Uh, and then there's what you're doing, which is uh, another kind of mega turn that involves the rest of the kingdom... Uh, that uses native village and bridge of support, but it's not just simple-minded native village bridge. I think that they're very, very similar in power level, and which one you ends up being dominant is just down to draws. So I'm going to advocate for native village bridge because it's there's less uh, user error that can cause it to <laughs> malfunction. Um, okay, and, well that's a and really I that they're about, and I think that they're about the same in power level. So like the fact that this uh, that the deck that I'm doing doesn't have this defect of like maybe you could screw it up um, yeah. is what <laughs> makes me go. What I mean, you use the same reasoning to justify rebuild on that uh, bridge troll mega turn. The, board, uh, uh, no, no, the, your deck actually the is worse argument. than this deck. Yes, and I, I, I never, I never used. No, no, no. I never, ever said that to advocate for rebuild. I mean, if I said I it, I was not being clip. serious. Like, it was clearly sarcastic oh, if I I'm, ever said that. Pull I'm the audio. I'm time stamping this. I'm time stamping this in the comments. You said that I dare you. you I'm certain of that. Said, no, no. I'm certain you of that because Rebuild because... is just as good of a deck. Because And, and it's not inflexible. The it's problem is Native Village deck. Bridge is inflexible. And the deck that I'm building can do things. So, so it is a you, better deck. It's not a better deck. It's just a. It's definitely it's not as fast, a better deck. Potentially, it's, and it's definitely a better deck, and it's, it's definitely as fast. Uh, not though. It's, it's the same. It's the same potency from what I've seen so far. Like it, the decks have the same prospects and the same level of speed. And from two games, except that the one where that one of them you got really lucky, up. and I did not get really not lucky. played it really well. Should I get an Ironworks? Or should I get a Crown? The Ironworks could just be a Crown next turn. I'm not really positive I can draw everything still. So maybe that doesn't hold. I guess I'll get the more flexible card. Feels kind of bad. Okay. Oh, wait, hang on. This was wrong. Hanging on. Whoa! That's all I wanted. That's pretty close to being cheaty, but whatever. Is that cheaty? It's not, but it's real close. Oh. I 
calculated that I needed to pick up cards. Like the only thing I, what I needed to do on, I had three bridges in my hand or the two bridges in my hand. I forgot that all I needed was the two coppers. So like information about what I set aside to make that decision. If you want to go back and make me pick up, I will. I don't care. Not really thinking I can get fountain points here. I've already trashed two coppers to my expand. It felt amazing. Oh, yeah, the coppers that... your deck, The deck you're building doesn't really go for those fountain points, does it? Well, it normally can, but I've had two times where I needed to... Um, you know expand to copper because I didn't have any estates thinking about iron works in a gold <laughs> I'm going to need to dominate like that's Crown. my plan what? Why would you take the gold instead? Are you worried about me piling crowns on you? I want to crown the gold. Huh? I want to crown the gold. That is a thing you could get to dominate someday. Next turn. I guess I am worried about the crown pile also. Wow, if I had gotten a crown, I'd be losing here. I would have preferred. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, let's uh, let's think. Can I win? I have three coppers, five. I have five coppers, 
So if I gain five coppers and a dominate and also empty piles, I could win. Can I do that? It takes nine gains. I have... Uh, up to nine gains. Sure, okay. And, and that doesn't even count gaining gainers and playing them, which I could theoretically do, but I don't think that helps. So, uh, what if I do all that? So let's say I crown ironworks, crown ironworks, crown expand. I can get uh, then I'm not crowning any of my treasures, and I'm going to hit 13. I have to buy the Dominate, and I can get two of the Coppers that way. Uh, but I could Ironworks one of the Coppers and draw it, or I could Ironworks the Coppers for money, and that gets me there. So I think this is possible. If I... If I crown if I expand moat and haunted woods into moat and moat then I uh, ironworks moat copper 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 and then I buy dominate copper copper that gets me uh, 30 points yeah, that should work. Woo! 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 Okay. Well, that happened. It took 16 yeah, I mean, turns. I had a dead hand, so... Uh... You were oh, that game well, on next turn, if not this one, so. Uh, you had that one comfortably. Okay, I want to play this with a 4-3 without thinking about contesting you, and if it feels like that last game did, then I need to reevaluate. I need to reevaluate ignoring this. Ooh, I hit double five. Look at me. Well, this is the draw. Nothing terrible has happened to me, and it's turn four already. Wow. So, I know, it's really unusual. So if it doesn't work out here, then... <laughs> then you'll <it's>, know. <laughs> then we'll, we'll all know, Jake. <laughs> we'll all know. Well, okay. So far, I don't think I would have done anything differently if I felt like I was contesting you either. It's just like this is a good draw. So now, um, oh, wait, I just get a moat. I should get a moat. That's probably a better card for my deck. I need to start getting crowns. Wow, look at all these terminals. All right, well, that was the first bad thing. Um, probably take this and this. Sort of want an ironworks and the mountain village. That's smart. Sure, let's get it, I guess. Seems fine. 
Oh, hold on. I had an extra buy, and things were too less. I should have used it. Oh, I should definitely get this native village. I say definitely, and then use an interrogative tone. I'll get a moat. Okay. Sorry. Oh, I should probably take something else. Probably take that native village, yeah. Oh, no. Oh, yes. He moated me. All right. My life is over. <sighs> Getting my haunted woods moated is the worst thing that's ever happened in my life, Jake. Ever in my life. Be you, man. Like, if that's the worst thing that has ever happened to you, I need to find out what gods your parents prayed to. <laughs> um, find out what I need to do about this. Um, well, you can only get three curses, so that's bridge. right. I want more moats. Probably. I want another moat. I want 55 moats. No, let's... I don't want to draw any villages. Villages are stupid. It's not like I have four of them in my deck. Jerk. Not you, the deck. A copper. Okay. Should probably follow suit. And get All the cool a kids copper. are buying copper. Not, be, not because you did it, but because I think that it, I actually should do it. Um, what else would I do? Yeah, it's my best call. Mostly just because there wasn't a whole lot else that was that great to do on that turn. And do you win this turn? That's my big question. How could I win? Unlikely, but you could. No, you're not winning There's this turn. There's only one pile empty. Huh? Of gains, you could. It's not that hard to end it from here. Yeah, it's really easy. Real question is why you can't do it, you noob. Right. You're such I'm a doing noob. Doing my best here, man. Yeah. Okay. This is interesting. So let's see. Um. Five. Maybe that haunted wood should have been a crypt, but I feel like that crypt was greedy. Maybe that, that should have been a crypt. Six gains. That's not enough. Uh, you need eight gains. Well, you only need six to end it, but if you want to win the game, you're going to need eight. So, sweet. I get to crown this question. silver. Can you win this turn, because if you can't, I'm pretty sure I win. I crowned a silver, Jake. Nice. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> I wish you uh, were playing a Haunted Woods this turn, because I have a moat in hand. I wish I was playing a Haunted Woods that turn, too. Okay, I guess I have to figure out why 
why I haven't gotten anything at all to happen by turn 14 in any of these games, when I was able to do that against the bot really consistently, I, I was like draining provinces on turn 12 and 13. But like this game, the bridges didn't empty. And this game, I didn't want more native villages. Like just what did I do? Like, I know I'm really tired, but like, I don't understand. I'm, taking, I'm contesting the bridges in native villages, so like, you but have that a didn't pile matter. That you don't, that okay. you don't have against the bot. Like, okay, you have to I play just... around a three pile in a way that you don't have to against the bot, right? I don't think any of that I mean, entered that into I'm this game. I'm not saying that did. I'm uh, saying that can't for be me, it. Um, huh? It's really difficult to talk when we can't hear each other, Jake. What's up? <laughs> this is going to be funny when I hear the full audio. I said it's really difficult to talk to you when we can't hear each other. <laughs> I'm like, wait, what? And then you said what? Okay. So, um... I need to Take go to bed. From these games, I um, I don't have okay. any takeaways. I learn. I know less now than what I did before we started. <laughs> nice. That was the goal, right? Um, yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna need to figure something uh, out, but we'll figure this out later tomorrow. Or and obviously we 